Hello and welcome to What Are You Saying? Hashtag Ways, where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all. I am Osayua Mesale and I am joined by the amazing Sandra Eze and the amazing Isi Afodile. Hello. <laughs> hello, 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 hello. I'm just happy to see Sanzi. <laughs> She's going to walk yeah, not the, the three weeks one. that she did not appear. She walks straight back yeah, to I was back. telling you earlier, it's, oh my goodness, is this a conspiracy? Yeah. I'm shook. Please, please don't be shook. <laughs> How are you doing, Isi? I'm very well. I'm oh, very well. I'm very well. I'm doing okay. And, you um, can see the Lord is good. The Quar Lord is quarantine, good. Quarantine uh, fat <laughs> pillows coming in. <laughs> I think, quite frankly, a lot of people <laughs> added weight. Although Uti somehow Uti has been doing a lot of ah, work, I, saw in her the I oh have information goodness. that Uti really? lost a lot of weight. Yeah. I'm like, seriously, what? girl, what wow. are you doing? When is she coming back so that we can get a snap of it? Uh, she will soon be back. She will soon be back. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. June 17. A lot of guys can't wait because that's when um, English Premier League resumes. So it's like it's heaven. Like the anticipation is literally like. <gasps> mm -hmm. That's for the football lovers. I'm not a football lover. I mean, different about football. Are you? <laughs> Well, I watch when I when I when I know that is not a team that I'm passionate about. Okay, here is the secret. If I like you as a guy, I'll watch football with you. If I don't like you, I'm sorry. Like I ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> oh, yesterday I gave a shout out to my parents. So today my sister in law Grace is her birthday as well. Wow. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Well, I have a lot of June people. I think Maureen's birthday was well, yes, um my younger sister my, as yeah, well. Yeah, my niece. So Maureen's birthday. birthday was um Wednesday. Yeah, I saw your post. Yeah, She's my little so sister pretty. Stephanie Eze. Happy birthday, my lovely. She's so pretty. Aww. And to think you wrote that she was a tomboy, I say, ah, uh, ah. Uh. She is, but she's... Oh, she's still she a still tomboy. Is. No, she was. She has she repented. Has, oh, that's yes. nice. She's trying to wear you dresses good and make up. Hmm. That is good. All right, so here's what we found as today's quote. Making a product is just an activity. Making profit on a product is the achievement. Because well, today we're focusing on making profit when it comes to business. Mm. Exactly. And it's very key for me. You know why? Um, especially because I know that the SME space, we have a lot of women in the SME space. But mm, a lot yes. of us, we're running our businesses like it's just, okay, it's just a thing on the side. Let me just mm -hmm. be doing it. And you see this empowerment. I mean, my sister, Faith, Okay. If she doesn't say, and if she hears domestic violence, she says that's why women need to be empowered. <laughs> anything she She's hears, not passionate about advocate. things like that. No, because anything she hears, she just believes that women need mm. to be empowered. They need to have money, mm -hmm. you know, so that so that when you are in a, so for instance, in an abusive environment, you can you can think, you can calm down and think, you know, exactly. Right. And it even buttresses the video we saw where the young woman was saying. Uh, her new husband she just married was having mm -hmm. an affair with her and at the same time her six-year-old daughter and now he's yeah. thrown both of them out. The daughter is now eight. He's already having sex with the daughter at six. So there are too many crazy oh. stories happening and I'm wondering, they asked her what was she selling. In Yoruba she said mm -hmm. she was selling oranges. So I'm wondering, imagine if How she was running a profitable orange? business, you know. Mm. So when I hear a lot of people empower, 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 let's not do, let's not play lip service. Exactly. Women need to understand that you have to run a business and you have to run it profitably. Right. Mm -hmm. So you can, you know, you can actually live the best of your life. I absolutely yeah. agree. Nothing also, more to add. It was also <laughs> said that um, if you as a salesperson, you make a sale until the person has given you money, that sale cannot it's, be counted. Yeah, absolutely. Yes, exactly. So today we're focusing on running a profitable business and we have Mo and Helen to talk to us. But first, let's take a break for what's in the news.